We don't know if we could put it on camera. We're just gonna go through all this stuff and then we'll, we'll, we'll show you the other thing. We have two versions of it. Ooh! I love that they put it like subtle on the inside. Never came out. Umra has 23 pair that's made. I think I saw these at the outlet one time. This is a GR, right? <laughs> yeah. So last night at about like 10 p.m., we decided to book a hotel room and take a spontaneous trip to Las Vegas. There's no main reason why we're going other than just we wanted to go. Also, one of my good friends who has a store out there, he FaceTimed me a few days ago and he had a pair of shoes that are so rare. He told me that the shoe is valued to be worth over $50,000. I don't plan to buy them, so don't think I'm gonna cash out on them. But yeah, that's, that's what we're doing today. So Vegas, we're on the way. So we just pulled up to selection. It's like 109 degrees outside, but I think it's hotter inside because they got some heat in here. That was the corniest line I've ever said on this channel. But yo, let's go inside. Let's see what they got. I'm going to be banging out two videos in here. One just about this crazy sneaker I'm going to show you guys. And another one with just a bunch of the shoes that they have in the store and some crazy PEs and exclusive and whatnot. So let's get it. I'm back, baby. Let's get it. All right, so he's pulling out all the PEs for us right now to look at. So we're gonna go through some of the stuff. Some of the stuff we might have shown last time we were here, but I don't remember what it is. So we'll just go through everything that he's brought out. There's tons on the wall over here, so he's bringing them out. Yeah, the box is a little messed up because I can't find the right box for the right shoe, but. You know what I'm saying? It's all about the shoes yeah, though, not the boxes. The so. so the one shoe that I was trying to put on camera, we don't know if we could put it on camera. We're, we're gonna we'll, find we'll out. We're gonna film it and then we have to get approval so maybe you'll see the video, maybe you won't, but um, yeah, we're just gonna go through all this stuff and then we'll, we'll, we'll show you the other thing. So let's start off with these right here. OVO 4s, never released. We have two versions of it. One of them is actually a glossy finish on the back tab and then one of them is more of like a matte finish. This is his personal pair, this which is, is a gloss. Yep. So this, one, this one's the glossy one, this is the matte one. This is a size 10, which is his personal pair. Um, I wish he would sell it to me, but he's not selling it for now, right? No. Maybe later? I no, I don't think I will. <laughs> I'll give you a shout out. No, I'm just <laughs> Oh, we might work some out now. I'll pay you for a shout out. But anyway, yeah, these are so fire. There's been rumors that these are coming out, but they're not coming out. Especially not with no OVO branding. You can see it. There's yeah. the owl in there. How much do these go for? 10 to 15,000, depends on the seller. Sheesh. Actually, I think one person has conceded. these. Conceded, yeah. yeah. I seen him wear these. This is the uh, Jordan the brand person. classic. Yeah. Is that what it is? Jordan brand classic. The midsole go crazy. Nine. Yeah, dude. Look at that midsole. It's like iridescent. Like, is that the right word? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Changing yeah. colors. Yeah. Like changing changing colors. colors. I'm not a big fan of nines. Uh, really? Yeah, I don't know. I just never have. Have you actually... played balling them? No, I haven't. Oh, man. I've, I've had like a couple pairs. I never ended up wearing them. This one's fire, man. I feel like this, if this ever came out, it would be like a, a girl's colorway. But it's still dope. It's super. Don't say that. I hope they don't. I spent kind of good. <laughs> <laughs> With Jordan Brand, you, you never, never know. know. You yeah. never know. This right here, if you know this box, this is a classic box, man. I think this is the same box that like the around the time when the Jordan 19s and the 20s came out. Oh, it was the 20s. My bad. The 20s says 20 right there. But Ooh, this is the first time I've seen these in person. Jordan 13. North Carolina. Yep. Look, look at that little logo right there. I love that they put it like subtle on the inside. It's not like super big on the tongue like they usually do, right? There's none on yeah. here. These are fire, man. UNC the quality they put yeah, on back in the day. Say, yeah. We don't get that no more. Yeah, man. This is, these are crazy, man. And then Jordan Brand, what they're gonna end up doing is releasing this without that right there. Watch. Probably. I took a hit on the threes, but whatever. I got them for free. Shout out to Jordan Brand. Uh, but wait, the single. Jordan 3 for free? Yeah. The, the PE? Yeah. Really? <laughs> to wear the sneaker con. Oh, wow. <laughs> uh, <laughs> that happened to me. He's going to go start a YouTube channel now. <laughs> yeah, I might have to now. <laughs> but uh, yo, this reminds me of the Carmelo Anthony PEs too. Which um, one? He had a bunch of 13s, I think, and they look similar to this. What is this one? Sorry. You good? The plug calling. Nike's calling. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so this one right here is actually, it looks like your regular Travis Scott 4, right? Yeah, right? It does. It, it really does, but... Yeah, look at the details. Look at the details. 
Nike Air Cactus Jack, and then the leather sock liner, which is not on the regular pair. This is the actual sample, friends and family sample. The leather sock liner is just so beautiful. It's so buttery. It's way more comfortable than the regular version, but. Well, the one that came out has a splatter yeah. and don't have Nike Air. Yeah, but this is just a cleaner look, like. A mm -hmm. cleaner That's look. the actual like friends and family like the mocha and purple and you could tell the quality is a little bit a little bit better too but yeah these are super fire i really like this version <laughs> oh i know i've shown these on camera before ovo 13 i was about 11. to say 13. ovo 11s never came out i don't know why all the good ovos are never came out they just gave us the 10s and the 12s but yeah these are super fire the only ovo logo on these is actually on the inside but I'm not gonna pull it out because the cardboard's in there and uh, it's just the owl. So these are fire and then there's another one. Shout out to Drake. Hey Drake, hit me up, reply to my DMs. It's been three years now, come on. Oh my god. Uh, <laughs> but yo, uh, these are fire. I like this one over the pink one, obviously, because it's, it's more wearable, but uh, these are bangers, man. What are these, like 15,000 each? Probably, I mean, I don't, I, it's because of size, I haven't really put a price on it. Damn. Next up, there was one that I skipped. I think it was that one, because I didn't know too much about that one. I just know that it's oh, like- Dave from, White? Yeah, it was like some artist, right? Dave White, Air Jordan 1. Rumor has a 23 pair that's made. Woo! Wow. Pretty wild shoe. Like they released that shoe in a black and white version. Yeah, there was a black and white yeah. version. I remember that one, but this is like a super exclusive one. So it looks like it's custom painted, but it's not, right? Actually, look at the you paint. He's an artist. Yeah, he's an artist, but if you actually look at the paint, it looks like it was just painted on itself with like a brush. So The nine. Oh, these are fire. He showed me these already. This is a Michigan nine. Full black suede upper. And then what did you say about the bottom? Uh, a lot of people has the one that has like extra sole. They called it the boots. Yeah, yeah, it's like the thicker boot version yeah, of the nine. Like uh, walking the snow. This one is that's just the regular. Have. This right. one's a regular nine. Regular bottom. This oh, is the... that's the. Uh, it's the wrong box because I can't oh. find the box. But. I know these are rare as hell. They are. Oh, shout out to wifey, hairdresser. I think I saw these at the outlet one time. This is a GR, right? <laughs> yeah. That's where I got mine. It was all I text you on. The new undefeated fours right here. Uh, these were remade for Drake. For Drake. That's what I heard. I wasn't 100% sure. But yeah, Drake, they were just making them whatever. But how many pairs do you think they made of these? Uh, it's less than the OG, that's for sure. I forgot yeah. the number. 30 something? Yeah, maybe? they made him a bunch of stuff. Uh, they were trying to keep him happy. That's why they, get, they made him his own fours. Yeah. yeah. He was complaining like, hey, you know, I, I love appreciate shoe, it. I love man. So, I honestly like the OG more because it's a little bit more darker of a green. And better quality. Yeah, better the quality. The like a sad now. Drake's a OG. size 12, that's a 12? No, that, that's not the shoe for Drake. Oh, but yeah, okay. that's they make it for like him yeah, and his yeah, boys. Yeah. But I never that seen him like even wear 12, it. Though. But the only reason they remade the shoe because Drake. Yeah. Or else they will never make it again. And the original story with this shoe right here was Eminem. M &M. This was made for Eminem, but there was a blue pair and then he liked the blue pair more, so they did the blue as the M&M, &M, and then Undefeated ended up just taking those. Yeah. If you didn't know, now you know. Oh, I this think, one's fire, bro. I'm I think not it's underrated. But super me, underrated. It's super comfortable. If I ever own the two lows, yeah. even the 13 lows, those two are so comfortable. It's funny is I was looking for twos, like the OG two lows, because I don't like the two highs, but the two lows I feel like are, is a good shoe to wear. This is the UNC Jordan 2 low. So many little details, like the upper has that like quilted uh, UNC uh, pattern on it. It's like a 3M. Yeah. Oh, it is 3M too? I believe so. And then like obviously you have the like buttery leather right here on the tongue and then it, you got the UNC logo and then you have that same print on the inside sock liner. And then when you go to the bottom, uh, yeah, it's kind of <laughs> it's kind of foggy, but is it these dead stock or worn? Yeah, it's dead stock. I haven't worn them yet. Yeah. And it has the shoe size on the bottom too, which is pretty cool. I don't know if all twos have that, but yeah, this is a fire pair, man. This was one of my favorites that he pulled out. Hey, for anyone out there with a 13 lows UNC size nine half ten, hit him up. Time. Zoom in on that right there. That's, I'm I not even gonna say anything else. I'm not gonna say anything else. These, I oh, I remember because I saw I love, him at Complex. Charles Oakley, Oakley? how you doing? Seven. I love this because this is the Jordan Three one. This was inspired by the Jordan Three. Tinker, right? Yeah, the Tinker. I might Tinker. I have a picture with them. Oh yeah, I met him at that event too. Remember? Yeah, and they did. I'm like, what's up, Tinker? I'm like, let's get a picture. And he took a picture. Well, remember he complimented your shoes? Yeah, yeah he, came, you up, he came up to me and he's like, he looked at my shoes because I had the Tinker threes on, and I didn't know. And then I just felt like somebody behind me, and I look, and he's like looking, and he's he put his shoe next to mine, and he's yeah. like, nice, nice shoe, shoes. huh? Nice shoes. I was like, damn. And then we oh. look up and we realize <laughs> it was him. Yeah. <laughs> Mina, I'm 
gonna put you to the uh on the spotlight if you could pick one shoe from this pile to take home which one are you taking Go grab it. You too, Ahmed. Does you it have too. To be my size? No, nah, it doesn't have to be your size. Oh. We're just doing this for YouTube content, you know? Okay. And then he said that you can actually take it home, right? Right. right. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, I mean, even though I said I'm not an 11s person, just for the simple fact that these are pink and then Drake, of course, I would have to go with these. What I you mean, like Drake? I could rock. You got a crush on Drake? Oh, all of a sudden. <laughs> all of a sudden. That's babe. Oh. Wow! <laughs> Who comes to Vegas yeah, and she's already wilding, bro? <laughs> what about you, Ahmed? I think I'm gonna go with the undefeated. Wow, because you're gonna resell them? Alright, you know what? <laughs> <laughs> Your girl's favorite! But no, I really like these. I just, uh, I think fours are my favorite, um, you know, silhouette. I have like you saw. I have the toes. Yeah, you've been, you've been. I've been getting four, so I think they look good on my feet, so I like them. For what me, probably undefeated as well. The OVO, OVO four. Yeah, oh that? yeah, the OVO. Not just that, because the bright four is one of my favorite shoes, yeah. and that one just like a little upgrade with bright fours. Yeah. yeah, somewhere in this pile of heat, like on this table, has at least what a hundred, hundred twenty thousand. Probably around there if you really had to put a number on there. Okay guys, so the shoe that we basically drove here to see <laughs> is not at the store, but we're still gonna see it. All right, we had to get- away in a vault in a safe. Yes, it's uh, he was kind of scared to bring it here because he didn't know if we could put it on camera or not But we got the okay to put it on camera. We're gonna show it to you guys It's probably gonna be one of the rarest shoes I've ever shown on this channel, which that's saying a lot You got a crazy sneaker in this box if somebody hit you up right now and They're like yo, I want those no matter what give me a price 60 70 60 70 K. I mean y'all probably already see it in the thumbnail, so I don't even need to tease it. All right, So we're gonna see some of his personal stuff here Morgan Oregon 14s. 14s. I mean, I showed it, but people still like to see like what people have in their collections. I don't get a chance to wear that yet. You said you have all the three PEs, right? Yeah. Georgetown, uh, Michigan. Oh. Screw these doors. These freaking. They gave me a check for all the broken lids. <laughs> Oregon, the white one. Yep, those are so fire. Then the black the one. The pit crew. Then what's That's my favorite right the there. The pinker ones. Actually, yeah. it's my favorite too. You can like, the money, you, you like can to, customize it. There's like four different side laces, four different side of swish. Then that's a UNC. The only one I'm missing just because I never had my size. Um, Marquette. Oh, yeah. The smallest you I have ever, one at the store, right? Yeah, the smallest one I ever find was a 10 and a half. And you got the freaking OVO 8s, the blue ones. I think you have that right. Right? No, I don't. I wanted to get them and then Yeezy bust the bottom from Mickey at Mag Park, and it's both of our same size. Don't you have the white one, the OVO 8? White? No, I don't have any of the OVO PEs. No, I, don't I, have, I have the Kobe 8. That's it. That Oregon 7 is so sick. So, too. this is the, this one, there's another Kentucky one. I don't know if you've seen it. it says UK right here, and yeah. the back is gold. Yeah, I've seen that one. My Ray Allen is signed from Hong Kong. Oh, really? Yeah, sneaker con. Oh, okay. yeah, mine was signed too, the 8. I have the white 8. Oh, you do? Nice. The 14, but I sold it. I regret nice. now. Yeah, I have I just, those. I just like the colorway. Yeah, that, I like that more than the version that came out. Oh, yeah. Oh, you have the M&M's? I didn't even know you had that one there. Yeah. Wait, bro, there's no way you just have that 6 chilling behind you and you're not going to pull it out. I mean, the 3. <laughs> right behind you, the 3. That's my freaking, like, dream shoe. What's not, the name? Not dream shoe, but like... this. Project that's... has it. Yeah, I know he does. I've seen it. Then, uh, oh, those are so fire. Michigan. Wow. It's your size. Wanna work on some trade? Oh. Yeah, I, can't, I can't wear this. It's too big for me. It's a 10? I am I need a 9.5 in 13s. Let me see. Put mm. it on. It's so comfortable, dude. 13 lows are very comfortable. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. You want, you, you want an Oregon 6? <laughs> <laughs> wow, those are fire, too. I love the freaking little side tabs that have speckles on it, man. They need to do that on a GR. You think you have the best sneaker collection in Vegas or what? Hell no. Nah. Who's better? I mean, there's actually Vegas is a has a lot of, like no name, like not popular ones, but yeah. they have a crazy yeah, collection, like, like older yeah. stuff. Air Forces is one guy I know, um, Chad. Oh yeah, the Blue Laces, Blue Lace Blue Gang. Laces. How about this? Oh, oh my God! Wow, the... that's my cue to leave. I'm uh, leaving, bro. Yeah, I'm, ta I'm taking these with me. Right. We're out. We're out. Hi guys, we just checked into our beautiful hotel room right now. We're staying at the Encore, which is my favorite hotel to stay at. It's part of the win. But yeah, man, Vegas is a vibe, man. You know, quick little one day trip. The spontaneous trips are the funnest in my opinion because you don't have high expectations of the trip. You just kind of go with the flow. And we're catching vibes out here, man. It's been a good time so far. We had some Earth Cafe earlier. Oh, we bought some shoes too. Not from a Chow's store, but from a store out here called 
What is it? Feature? So uh, we actually got some shoes for retail and Ahmed over here. Ugh, another reseller mistake, right? No, nah, not really a reseller mistake. So we got some shoes. Um, I'm the first one to post it on StockX. And so I think they should sell. But right now I saw them on Shoe Pass. They're sitting there, but I think they'll sell out eventually. <laughs> so he bought it. When we were in the store, I said, this is a good personal pickup. Bro, if, but nobody has posted it on StockX. All right, so let me show you guys what we did pick up because these were uh, sitting there. They just got them in stock today. And it's a shoe that I... I I actually really like and I had a pair before but I actually had them in the wrong size so these right here are the it's, it's a new balance which you probably didn't expect that and these right here are the new balance 55 Sorry, I said that wrong. New Balance 550s, 550s in this forest green color. As you guys can see, a very clean silhouette. I love this because it's like a old school basketball shoe. It's got that cool New Balance logo on the tongue. This was definitely an easy cop for me. Retail was only 120 bucks. No camp out, no raffles, no stressing. Literally, we walked into the shoe store and we copped the shoes. So nice little pickup. And uh, let me know what you guys think of these. <laughs> on feet, they look good with the stand socks. You you know the vibe baby anyway man we got vegas vibes we're gonna be chilling for the next couple of hours and then we're going to dinner tonight i'm saying whatever happens after that i guess like drake says let's see what's about to happen next <laughs> oh my god all right Wadi had these. You sold this one already? Yeah, sold right now. Wow! <laughs> Refund the order! 